So, snapper. They're probably one of the most sought after fish in New Zealand and they can be a real challenge to spear because they're pretty smart and they don't like the sight of divers. Where I'm based and do the majority of my diving in Wellington, New Zealand, we do get snapper, but they're very seasonal and you hunt them completely differently down here to how you would further north. This video actually starts about a year ago at the start of spring 2019. Uh, at this point I hadn't even shot a snap before and I hadn't really done much diving outside of Wellington. My mate Aiden had just moved from Wellington to Whangarei so I thought I'd make the most of this opportunity and head up there to see him and do some diving with him to try to shoot a snapper. I actually found this really hard. On the first day I lost a snapper and then after that I barely saw any snapper for the rest of the trip. I put this mostly down to my inexperience in hunting them. It wasn't until the third day of the trip when I was swimming along a piece of coast and I just swam straight over the snapper swimming in the weeds. I saw it, it didn't see me, so I did my best to quietly drop down onto it and put a shaft into it. point I was just really stoked to have been able to shoot a snapper. After this I continued to snoop ledges looking for snapper and actually as I was coming up over this ledge I saw the scorpion fish just sitting right there. Uh, this was another new species for me so I was really happy to be able to tick off two new species in one day. Being a Wellington diver, another species we don't get down here is Pink Mau Mau. So we thought we'd try and make it three new species in one day and head out to this rock to try shoot a pinky off it. While there weren't any pinkies there, there was this big school of blue Mau Mau vortexing and it was pretty cool to watch. myself I wasn't coming all the way to Northland to shoot kingfish since we get plenty of them in Wellington in summer but I couldn't help but plug a kingfish as three of them swam past at this rock. So 
So fast forward a year to the start of spring 2020. I'd actually been trying to get up to see Aiden again for quite a while, but a whole lot of things have been getting in the way, like the COVID-19 lockdown. Uh, the trip finally came together, so I was pretty excited to get up there, get in the water outside of Wellington and hunt snapper again. The conditions weren't great this trip. There was swell and the viz was pretty bad, uh, but it still all came together on the first day. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't film a lot this trip, but I did get the one bit of footage of the fish that made the trip all worth it. I was creeping up over this ledge that we had a burly on, peered over and saw a good number of fish down there, including one good sized fish. spear two snapper with one shot and one of them being my PV snapper at 19 pounds and the other one was around about five pounds. I think I got pretty lucky with this fish and I've got a lot to learn still when it comes to hunting snapper. Um, but I'm just looking forward to the next time I can get up there and do it all again.